You know, as, a, as parents, you try to raise your kids the best you can and to, you know, instill the qualities and character values that you want. But I think it's unrealistic to think that you can do it alone. A time to, to invest in the kids is when they're in junior high and high school, because that's, that's truly when they're understanding just who they are and who they are in Christ. And I just think to take the chance of putting them in a place where you get this false identity of the influence of the peer pressure of their friends and, and society, it's not worth it. It's not worth the risk. If you have the benefit of having a school that, that agrees with you and how to do that, and family and friends that do the same thing, then I think that's, that's truly the, the best way to be successful. And I think the size was the appeal to me to begin with, just the, the smallness. We wanted a place where the kids would be known and where they could be involved in a lot of different things. You know, we want our kids that if they wanted to do sports one year and drama the next year, they could do that or be involved in music. They could do that and not feel like they're, you know, didn't start in soon enough or got left behind in that process. I think our kids have grown spiritually significantly through this whole journey. You know, I think it's um, on a daily basis being involved with uh, so many different teachers that just invest in them um, as a friend, as a spiritual mentor, and to watch their relationship grow with God through that journey. They're all four just solid. They just, they're passionate about Jesus, which is huge. I mean, that's what we wanted as we raised them. And then to see that another school came alongside and just empowered them to be confident in their walk with the Lord has been amazing. In early, I think eighth grade or ninth grade, one of the teachers here at Cole Valley just saw something in him and they're like, Jace, you would be awesome at doing something like going on the world race, which is a mission trip that you go to 11 countries in 11 months. He leaves Coal Valley, goes to college, and a year later comes back and is like, I feel like this is something I need to do. Went on the world race and did this mission trip for a year and it changed his life. He changed others' lives for Christ. And yeah, I don't think my son would have gone on the world race at all without the influence of the teacher here at Coal Valley. You know, honestly, I'm just so proud of my daughter that she chose for her senior project to actually do ministry, to go out and to make a difference in her own community. And I don't know of another school where you could have done that. I think what's been instilled in here over the years is this love for others. And for her, that was working with refugees locally. And she could have chose anything. And for her, she wants to keep going. You know, she wants to keep doing this beyond the requirements of her project. Even parent-teacher conferences, and you hear a little bit about their heart, I mean, I just walk away just almost sobbing in the car because I'm so thankful for this community. I am so thankful that our family has been able to be a part of it. I, I just can't imagine where our kids would be right now without that because I know it's been such a critical part of their just their growing up years. You know, if you want your kids to know who they are and to, and to grow up in a way that is safe and friendly and uh, encouraging and positive and for them to be able to discern what is right and what is wrong and what can be acceptable and how to love others that don't agree with you, then I wouldn't hesitate to go to Cole Valley. But we have some friends that maybe think we've sheltered our kids by putting them in a Christian school and I just don't agree. I think we have given them such solid foundation now for them to go out in the world and be able to talk about Christ with ease and be passionate about Him and want to serve Him. It wasn't about sheltering them, it was about nurturing them. We have no regrets. It's something that we would do again. It's something that we've been very impressed with at all levels. It's just a win-win. I mean, it really is.